And just a few days ago, Master Lot closed its Milwaukee plant after more than 100 years and hundreds of job, jobs moved out of the city. As Aaron Maven explains tonight, people in the city's Amani neighborhood say that closure leaves a huge financial and emotional wound. The Amani neighborhood was once a thriving neighborhood. At the Dominican Center in Milwaukee, Marisha Harris speaks about the past and the present. The neighborhood today faces um, significant challenges, but it's because of the decades upon decades of divestment in this community. Harris is executive director of the Dominican Center in the city's Amani neighborhood. The nonprofit works tirelessly to uplift the community. We sat down with Harris shortly after Master Lock shut down operations at its Milwaukee plant. Master Lock is just reflective of that same history that we've seen over the past several decades. It's another manufacturer leaving this part of the city, an area that once boomed with industry. I miss A.L. Smith. We had a hope with Talgo at first. The manufacturing jobs have left, and so when the jobs left, money left, a lot of divestment happened. After the closure, Harris and Crystal West, who lives nearby, hope companies invest in this area. Give where it's most important. You see future leaders come out of this neighborhood. They hope that includes more funding for green jobs and sustainable industries. Companies are closing, but we're not trying to keep the buildings open that's doing the work. We want employers, we want grocery stores, we want amenities to locate in or near the Amani neighborhood so that the people who live in this community have access to everything that they need. A push for investment and opportunity all for a brighter future for this neighborhood. In Milwaukee, Aaron Maben, Fox 6 News.